Okay, uh, we we'll, uh, start in this position, okay? Uh, I want to have the kiss of dragon. So I I teach something uh, I like like too much do, but sometimes work, sometimes no work. Okay. We need uh, first feeling how much is my opponent have the strong uh, uh, invest the lanier, okay? Because I need to move my knee in this direction for the other side, okay? I like for uh, drop down my uh, my legs like that and then step the other legs, okay? But if my my opponent have a strong the lanier, first I need broken step here, step back. Okay, like step my my legs between his legs, like here, and now I can move more easy my knee on the mat, and then turn my other legs here. Okay, I can turn my legs over his head. Okay, my opponent has the here. Okay, here first I need uh, like. Uh, take off his hook because he's very tight. Then I strike, and now I control the collar and I step between his legs. Boom. Okay. Now I move. I put my knee down here like that, and then uh, turn my legs over his head. Boom. And at the same time, I close his legs so he cannot back easily. And then when he try back the legs, I directly inside the hook. Okay? And I just grab in two hands. <clears throat> Again. My, my opponent make the event the here, a piece of drag. So he's strong. I need first broken his uh, take off his hook, so I strike. And now I start for back. Or step between his legs, like a little bit sit my in his legs. Okay, put my butt in his hook, and now I have more like a space for put uh, drop down my knee on the floor. Okay, when I move my knee on the floor, I turn the legs from the uh, over his head and the uh, knee like leave my weight in his legs oh, but I still control his legs I'm not leave away because if I leave away he can uh, like move the hip and then recover so I need control okay when I put my knee on the mat the same time I turn the legs for the other side boom and then put my my body and on top of his legs okay now he automatically make this for the fence himself because I'm going directly for grab in two hands. Now I just inside the hook, then now I can control the tricep or try go or try grab the, the neck. Sometimes it's hard to go directly for grab and just control the, the elbow here, stabilize the position and after try grab. Okay? Here, my opponent make the heel here. He's very strong, I start. Step back. Okay? Control here. I can also inside the other position, like leg with here, but I want to pass from this position. I want to surprise him. So I just move my knee down, turn the legs, and leave my weight in his legs. Now I go directly from the hook. For, uh, for sure, my opponent start for push me, push me. And I control the elbow here. Okay. Elbow and stabilize the, the side control. If sometimes when I hear and the my opponent can uh, push me here, like this, I go directly in the, his, uh, behind his neck. Okay. And now in this moment where I can turn the arms inside from his legs and come with my head in his stomach. Okay, the hands and behind his his back is just for I'm not lost the control. Okay, I'm here. Well, then put the knee on the mat, turn the leg straight. Now he pushes. I control the mat. Boom. 
Okay, that's why I'm not lost the control because if I don't have the grip, he can push me away and I need to make more force use my energy for stabilizing. But if it's still close in his body, like the push me, I still close in his body, I just can just fall over him. And into my my head. Okay? Okay? Everybody understand? You want to cut it? Oh.